Happy Friday, everyone. Welcome to another edition of Friday Chatter. This is Grant here at Ruby Falls. Uh, we got a couple of updates for you, uh, goings on here at Ruby Falls and also around town for the holiday weekend. So let's get started. All right, first off, cave walks uh, for today are already sold out, unfortunately. So if you were planning on coming through, uh, note that we do not have any more availability. Uh, but if you're planning on coming through on Saturday or Sunday, be sure to go to rubyfalls.com right now and check on our availability. It being a holiday weekend, we will definitely sell out. And we want you guys to be able to experience this adventure. So, so don't miss out on that. While you're at rubyfalls.com checking on the availability, go ahead and purchase your tickets right there because we're not gonna be selling any tickets from the counter uh, on site this weekend. Uh, plus by the time you get here, unfortunately, we probably would be sold out. So go to rubyfalls.com right now. Uh, check the availability for Saturday or Sunday, especially if you're coming uh, from out of town. We don't want you to be disappointed when you get here. So, all right. Uh, also, we have our High Point Zip Adventure, uh, which is open today and tomorrow, Saturday, from 9 to 5 p.m. Uh, you can climb our 40-foot tower and soar through treetops over 700 feet of rushing zip lines. So uh, that's an awesome adventure that we have to offer here on the property. Uh, so if you're coming through, be sure to check that out as well. Go to rubyfalls.com. Book your time slots in advance. That is another thing that will most likely sell out, it being a holiday weekend again. So, All right, let's talk about events going on in Chattanooga this weekend. Check out the Black Friday open house on the Bluff. The Bluff is the art district in Chattanooga. It's up near the Walnut Street pedestrian bridge, and it's almost like a little European village full of artisan shops, museums, and, uh, and coffee houses. It's just a really cool little place. But they're having a holiday market where they're going to have uh, obviously holiday shopping, artisans demonstrating their craft, pastry chefs, and, and again, it's just going to be like a little European holiday market. If you are planning attending the uh, Black Friday open house on the bluff, I will be sure to post the address uh, where you can find out more information for that in the comments below. All right, now it's time for the restaurant picks of the week. And speaking of the Bluff View Art District, both of our restaurants this week are on the bluff. Uh, so the first we're gonna talk about is Tony's Pasta Shop. Now they are open for lunch and dinner and they describe themselves as being traditional Italian and Sicilian dishes made with garden ingredients served in a casual setting. But I also happen to know that they do make all of their pasta fresh on site. So that's pretty cool. Their dining options currently do include socially distanced dine-in, curbside pickup and delivery with their entrees ranging from $11 to $17, just FYI. All right, the second place we're gonna talk about is also on the Bluff View, uh, and it's called Rembrandt's Coffee House. Now, they are open for breakfast, lunch, and dinner, and they specialize in soups, sandwiches, and salads, ranging from $6 to $10. Now, they do have something special that I recommend. Uh, it's called the Tomato Artichoke Soup, and it's only $4, so check that out if you get a chance here, looking for something unique and interesting. Uh, now, they also serve, of course, since they're a coffee house, assorted espressos, uh, coffees, teas, and frozen drinks. Now, all of this information for the holiday market uh, at the Bluff View and uh, the two restaurants are at bluffviewartdistrictchattanooga.com. That is a mouthful, but I'll be sure to post that link in the comments below uh, so you won't have to remember that. So. All right, now as a final reminder before I sign off today, Hamilton County is under a mask mandate still. So uh, when you show up to Ruby Falls or any of these places we talked about uh, in Friday Chatter, please be sure to bring your masks and to make sure you wear them over your mouth and your nose while in indoor spaces and when you're in close proximity to other people. All right, guys, that is it for this week. We will see you next time. You guys, uh, happy Thanksgiving, and we hope you have safe travels this weekend. Bye.